Perioperative care refers to care provided around the time of surgery, and this can be organized into three phases. The preoperative phase starts at the time of the decision surgical intervention is made and ends when the patient is transferred to the operating room table. As the nurse, some key responsibilities are completing an admission assessment and getting vital signs, getting the patient's health history and medication history, including any allergies, pre-op education, making sure the patient voids and has all necessary belongings removed, getting IV access, and making sure the consent form is signed. The intra operative phase starts at the time the patient is transferred to the operating room table and ends when the patient is admitted to PACU. There are specific roles in the OR that make up the operating room team, and as a nurse, you may play the role of circulating nurse or scrub nurse. This is also when a process called a timeout will be performed, where the surgical team pauses to clarify information to prevent any harm to the patient. This is when it's verified that it's the right patient, right procedure, right site, and right markings. The post-operative phase starts when the patient is admitted to the PACU and ends after follow-up evaluation. In this phase, as the nurse, she'll be closely monitoring the patient's ABCs and vital signs as frequently as one minute depending on the phase, and will be monitoring level of consciousness, pain, surgical site, complications, etc. If the patient is being discharged home, this is also when patient education will be done. Comment below if you've ever been interested in working in a surgical setting and check out the full study sheet in the Nursing School Success Bundle.